Today, we're gonna break the bean mystery. Let's get it. Today, we are uh, trying some baked beans, if you haven't figured it out from the uh, intro. Bushes baked beans, to yeah. be exact. Um, they got a bunch of different flavors and styles. Um, some of them are grilling beans, some of them are home style beans. Um, so I kind of, I mean, they're all baked beans, I guess, yeah, technically. They're, they're all technically baked beans, but we want to find out what's the best. What's the, the best flavor? Yeah, the, the best. Now, we are missing one because they don't have it out in shelves yet, but it's called Sweet Heat. So That's the one you were kind of looking I was hoping it was going to be there because I like spicy. Um, but uh, this is all the uh, the flavors the grocery store offered. So, yeah. and uh, a lot of flavors. Here's a tip since he didn't have any idea how you do it, but we actually cook these on the grill in the can. Uh, I used to do this at, when I go camping. You just put, uh, pop the top, put it next to the fire or pretty much on top of the fire, uh, stir every now and then. It cooks pretty quick, and then you got you know it's in your can. You can eat it right out of the can. Can of beans there. Um, so that's how we cook them. We just put them on the grill. I went and cook everything about the same time. Uh, probably most of them are decent temperature because we didn't cook them that long. Yeah. Um, just trying to get this video. We are not really cooking beans anyway. You're, you're, you're heating up, up beans. <laughs> yeah. A lot of the flavors and stuff. Trying to get the flavor, the juices and stuff to go together here. So. Uh, I don't know how we're going to start this off. Which one do you want to try out first? I know which one I want to leave kind of the last or one of the last ones. And I think I want to leave that one for the last because it's got bacon in it. I think they all got bacon in them. Not every well, one most of them. Most of them. Some of them do. But this one's, I like how it so. I think we should start out with the original. Oh, okay. So the original. Yeah, move to like home style. Then, you know, get further away from the the basics. We'll, we'll go into the more <laughs> wild. Still warm. So... Oh, what's funny is I was wondering how hot that was getting because I didn't even touch it. I just let it go. Oh, okay. So, just going to pour some, you some of these beans some here. Beans. They're kind of warm. There you go. I'm just going to eat it right out of the can. Um, show them. Show them. Give them a close up on the so, beautiful bean footed chair. Oh, well, yeah. We're going to get copy strike for that. <laughs> Thank you for that. After I told you not to do it. <laughs> we don't own these beans. Or that, or we're that, not affiliated. Or that Satan, neither are we affiliated. Yeah, that's copyright by Bush, is, uh, <laughs> I'm sure it is. Um, but these are the original. Um, it says seasoned with bacon and brown sugar. I don't see any bacon in, in here. Do you see any bacon? I mean, not my side. Maybe they just make you think it's bacon. Does it say bacon on the front? Mm -hmm. It says right there, bacon pieces. Um, that's pretty warm. Yeah, this definitely got warm. <laughs> Can's a little warm too. Um, no bacon in here, but it's 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 baked beans. Yeah, I mean I can eat them. I like baked beans. These are a good standard, good starting point. Yeah, so so in my in my variants of I just gotta leave that in the middle until you know that's that's our. So I, you can't see it, but, yeah, but this is home style right here in the middle with. Our, our rating of yeah, it's, we got the little baby cans with the ones because they're a little cheaper. But all the others are big except for the home style. But, but the original is you know that's, that's the middle standard. So we might get better, we might get worse. We yeah. Um, I think I want to go with home style next. Um, we went from go from original to home style. I guess would be a good and it's another small can. Yeah, and it's it's I mean that seems like it would just be the next step up. You think? What's home style to us? Did we ever? Did anybody ever? Yeah, make I'll tell you right now, it looks thicker. Home style beans. You didn't get a, here. You want a bowl for trash? Well, I was kind of hoping you had a napkin, a napkin of some sort, but I was wiping on the. That's why the good Lord made pants? I guess. <laughs> I think there's only two I need for trash, anyways. You got a beard? I ain't wiping in my beard. You crazy? <laughs> All right, this one's a little hotter, so I gotta be careful. That's redder too. Very, yeah. very bright. Looks almost like a pork and bean. All right, this one says uh, tangy sauce with bacon and brown sugar. So I guess it's a tangier sauce. I know you can't probably just tell it, but yeah, that's it smells the, spicier. The home style. I like a spicy smell to it. Definitely smells different. And there's a huge piece of bacon fat in this one. Mm. That's the best part. It's not sweet. No. Um, 
Me tastes more like pork and beans. Yeah, that's what kind of to me. Um, this one also says 97% fat free. I'm honestly, I think it's lower than the regular one. Yeah, I definitely would. I'd, I wouldn't. I would rather that rather have the original compared to the home style. Yeah, when I think baked beans, I think sweet. Yeah. So the, um, the problem here is, I think that it has uh, brown sugar in it, but I think yeah, it's just over here. Right. Which is which is our least my higher. higher. Okay. Yeah. I don't know because I'm looking. I'm I'm going for what I look. Oh, at, okay. So, yeah. Just know this is the least side and this is the higher side. All right, which one do we want to go next here? Um, we got country style. Yeah, let's go country style because that sounds like it's the next level. Now this one's ninety eight percent fat free. Is that other one said ninety seven? Yeah, this one said ninety seven. This one's ninety eight. So it's a percentage higher. <laughs> it's a percentage higher, more fat free. I don't know if that's a good thing or not. Thick, rich sauce with bacon and extra brown sugar. Extra. It looks thick. Oh, you can see the bacon oh, pieces man. right there. It's, you know it's good. It's got bacon in it. Oh, yeah. That's thick. That is thick. That's some thick bangs. Um, country style. Oh, you can smell. It smells better than the last one. Oh, it does smell good. No, it's warm. <laughs> yeah, it didn't get as warm. I was like, I was like what? It's cold. Um, Still good, though. Yeah, better than home style. Oh, yeah, way better home style. I mean, it's a little bit better than the original, too. Yeah, I got extra brown sugar helps. And you got two big bacon pieces in yours. I don't know. And that bacon was good, too. I took about it. Did you? Um, yeah, I'm going to have to place it in front of the original. Yeah, I think that was, that was pretty good. Uh, not bad. And fat, fat free. Not even yeah. fat free. So we're losing weight while we're eating this, people. You you complain about how much we eat all the time. I'm going to tell you right now, he's going to be losing even more weight after we're all done with this. <laughs> There's a lot of fiber. I'm glad I'm not going to have to be around him. <laughs> fiber in the beans. Um, let's go. With, well, let's go with the bourbon and brown sugar. So we're all brown sugar everything. Yeah, well, I think I, yeah, most of it's going to um, have brown sugar in it. Or do you want to go to Steakhouse? I feel like Steakhouse is going to end up like right above original or maybe just below it because it's got some well if it's going to be right there then might as well just go ahead and yeah, try that one in. is it a thicker sauce or what's yeah. what's the what's in what's the what's it say on the front an authentic blend of beans brown sugar simmered in a roasted steak sauce steak sauce i like steak sauce it's thick oh man and it's hot i'm burning my fingers <laughs> see the inside's hot Oh man, you can tell us the difference in smell. It's spicy smell. Oh yeah, it is. That's that pepper. You can taste the green peppers. They're kind of strong. They are very strong. Overpowering a little bit. Because um, that's all I'm tasting. Yeah, I feel like that's you know some people might disagree with me, but I feel like you don't need to add much to baked beans. No, I think they're good the way they are. I don't think um, you need that extra stuff in it. now. The steak sauce does add an interesting flavor. It depends on what you're wanting to eat it with. Yeah, I mean, it, it would have to be a steak or something. Yeah, uh, but something I don't match flavors. I mean, I quite, I don't really care for the peppers myself. Um, I don't think you need it. I think without the peppers, it'd be a better. Yeah, this would go good. Like if you're making like a cowboy bean. Yeah, like something with some meat in it. I think it would go better with it than it just by itself. But where do we put this? I don't know. Do you think it's? I mean, it's. It's hard to say if it's better than. I don't think it's worse than Homestyle. I think well, no, Homestyle's home definitely pretty. down this way. The question is, does it go right here or on the other side? Does it hit there or there? I, I feel see. like it just goes with it, because mainly I feel like it's what you use it with. Well, I can see that, but me, you know, if it, to me with these flavors, you got to be better than the original. Yeah, and I don't think it does that. I think you, you I have agree. to have it with something else to so. make it, you know. Yeah. Originally, you can eat it with whatever you want to. This, I think you have to eat it with something that get calls yeah. for that. So I'm going to have to put it below. Just below. I think we'll... All right. Agree, I guess. Here's the bourbon and brown sugar. Roast, uh, robust beans with a touch of natural bourbon flavor. <laughs> so. A touch. A touch. Because <laughs> it's burger, you need like a little uh, 
one of them little, what do they call them things? Uh, That's hot too. That is hot. <laughs> I bet it is. The uh, what's what's a little flask or whatever the glasses people use to you drink didn't give me a spoon there, buddy. Oh, sorry. I'm conserving spoons here. Hopefully, I got enough. Looks like it's got onions in it. Like hot. It's good though. Wow, that's different. That is different. You can taste what I would think to be bourbon. Yeah, and you know, to me, on the back of this, kind of, it, it, it makes sense. It goes with uh, chicken, apples, sausages, or or something like that. To me, when I'm eating this, I'm thinking a um, brat. Yeah, bratwurst. Like, a brat would go great with this. But, then again, burgers would go good with this. Yeah. A uh, chicken would go, I mean, this is good. I guess with their grilling beans, they try to be a little bit more savory. Not as sweet. I mean, there's a sweetness to this. There's a little bit of sweetness, but you taste that bourbon. Um, it actually gives like a smoked kind of. Yeah. Like a smoky charred barrel. What do you think? I don't think it's as good as the... What is that one again? What was that one? The country style? Country style. But I think it is definitely it's better, better than, than home it. style. Or I mean the original. original. But way better than home style. Yeah. Um, yeah, I think it's good. All right. Uh, what we got left here? Southern Pit Barbecue. Or let's just go Southern Pit. We're kind of going off of a Southern kind of thing here. This one's slow cooked beans in a rich barbecue sauce with for an authentic grilled flavor. This one looks has, has red peppers in it instead of green peppers. Mm. I wonder what that changes. Is that gonna be spicy or is that gonna now it's more of the color of what the uh, home style was. Looks kind of like a uh... oh man, it smells like spaghetti sauce. Yeah, it kind of <laughs> does. <laughs> Maybe that's tomato mm -hmm. instead of I think there is tomatoes in there. Maybe it's not peppers. Maybe it's tomatoes. I think it's both. I think I read toma tomatoes on the back. I know I read red peppers. Tomato puree, tomato paste, onion, red bell pepper. So it has both in it. So, I mean, when I think like pit barbecue, I'm thinking it's gonna, this is going to taste like a vinegary barbecue sauce. <laughs> that tomato puree is overpowering. Tastes like Chef Bourdain. <laughs> that, is, that is not as good as I was hoping it would be. Why is this? I don't understand why it's called Southern Pit Barbecue. You think they really wanted to make taste like a barbecue sauce? That doesn't taste like any barbecue sauce I've ever. It had. says rich barbecue sauce. Maybe like that Stubbs, because it was kind of like that kind of ketchupy or a Maybe, spaghetti yeah. sauce. I would eat it. I think it's better than home style, but I don't think it's. Um, I don't know if there's anything worse than home style. Yeah, home style's <laughs> so far down here. I, th I don't know if those were better. Yeah, I think these were better. Um, they were. I think they were a little spicier, and I kind of like that. All right. It's once again, it's one of the things that you have to choose certain yeah, things that, to eat with. And this one says uh, boneless pork loin. I don't see it. That's kind of weird. Just some bacon. Yeah, I don't see uh, see that recipe on. I mean, I just don't see it being a good one. All right, let's go with um, let's go with just regular honey sweet, seasoned with honey, specially cured bacon. Seems simple enough. Hmm. Right, that for you? Oh, wait, oh wait, no, going door. I don't really have a strong smell that to it. Bourbon got me drunk. And I did it. And then cook enough off. <laughs> yeah. We didn't leave it in on the grill for long enough. This one don't have a strong smell to it at all. No. It's, it smells very familiar, though. That's not what I expected it to taste like. Loki going off on somebody. It kind of tastes a little bit like original. A little bit sweeter though. Yeah. I don't I like the beans. It's like, did they use a different bean? I don't think so. How do the beans taste more beany? 
more flavor of the bean. Beans taste more bean. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know. I don't know how to describe. It tastes more like a bean. I don't know. I think it's a little sweeter than the the original style. Well, it's not brown sugary. It's honey. Yeah, it's got honey in it. Um, I mean, it's got loads of honey in it. There's no brown sugar. It's no. just honey. It's not what I would normally call a baked bean because you know I think baked beans. I think brown sugar. Yeah. But um, I like it. It's not bad. It tastes good. It's I think different. It's, I think it's a hair above original because yeah, it's I got think more so flavor. Too. Yeah. I think I think it depending on what kind of sweetness you want. Yeah. Because the original has the brown sugar sweetness. This one has the honey sweetness. Honey gives it a little bit sweeter flavor. Yeah, just I think, a tad bit. I think it takes the less. That must be what it is. Just takes less away from the bean. Maybe that's what it is. Because I can taste beans. You almost lose it. No, it's slick because of the size. <laughs> yeah, it boiled over a little bit. All right, so what we got left? Honey chipotle, yeah, onion, honey. and maple cured bake. Let's go with the other honey then. Yeah. This one's uh, tender beans sim simmered in a spicy chipotle sauce with a touch of honey. It's a good thing they're tender beans. I'd hate to have tough, hard to eat beans. That one's, that one's interesting smelling. It's going to be spicy, I think. Man, them beans are big. They're thick. I'm some, I'm some hearty oh, beans. With a metal there, be careful. All right, that's paper. Yeah. A, little, a little shaving. Oh, I see. We'll just expose that. We'll dispose of that. I mean, you can smell that from a mile off. Yeah, it's, that's interesting. Oh, wow. And that's that's wild. It tastes like uh, the mango habanero from Buffalo Wild Wings. <laughs> Gonda. I kind of want wings now that I'm eating this, you know. That would be good with some, some chicken of some kind, for sure. Huh. I like it. That's that's not bad. If you want some spicy, I mean it's spicy. It's not like it's not overpowering crazy, spicy. Huh? It's got it's got a kick to it. It's not I mean, overpowering. It's on the it's back, on the back of the throat. Yeah. Burns. It's making my mouth water. I'm slobbering on myself. Um, wow. I like it. I did too. It's just got like a lot of onions in it. Where to put this one? So far, I think it's been the best one. For me. for my taste, I would say yes. For me, people been... who don't like spicy stuff, though, I think we still have to hold it back behind just a normal sweet. But this ain't like super spicy, though. Well, it's not. But if if I taste a little heat, I know certain people mm. who'd be like, "Oh, it's, yeah, this is flaming." I think you're right. But for my taste, this is by the by far the best one so far. Yeah, if you like spicy stuff, that's going to be the one you want to go to. Um, that's good. It's Especially brand new chicken. Chicken, like any kind of barbecue. Yeah, go good, really chicken, good with chicken. Yeah. Be you know. All right. All right. I'm gonna go with onion next. Let me clean the old spoon. You got spoons? I'm up. Um, <laughs> I'm, gi I'm giving you the new ones. Well, we've only got two left. We got. I think we won't. I've got enough um, for just a couple. One more. Yeah, one more. Yeah. Of those. All right. This is, this is the onion seasoned with bacon and brown sugar and onion. Which is weird to me because like I just seen onion and I was thinking, you know, I think savory with onion. It's I don't think smells like regular beans. I don't think uh, baked beans, but they are baked beans, aren't they? Yeah, I mean, they're supposed to be. I mean, baked beans, yeah. Brown sugar. It says baked so, beans on the front. It's just not a whole lot of flavor. It, you can definitely smell the onion. It's actually not bad. It's sweet. Yeah, I wasn't, I wasn't expecting it, but... That's a sweet onion in there. I really like this. Mm, it's not bad. It's not what I thought it was going to be. I had a high, higher hopes for it, I think. Well, you're like a super onion person. You like onions. And it's good. I mean, it's good. I don't think it's um, the top good. But no. it's not bad. Um, I think it would land right here. All right, what have we got there? That's the brown sugar. Man, that's a hot can. Uh, <laughs> Told you. And between honey chipotle. I definitely don't think it's better than that. No, I think it lands right I here. Like, I mean, like it just barely maybe yeah. just barely past it's hard like i would almost put it on the same level as the brown sugar 
one of your friends or his fault behind us there. Um, yeah, you would put it behind this one. I would. I would put it. I put it at even. Well, I don't want to think it's even. better. I, I'd go a little bit above. Then it. it would move it up. Yeah, I'd go a little bit above it there. Slide yeah. your cans over there, but only because you think it's better. But I think that it would be even with it. But just because I think if like you want just any kind of food, yeah, this would go with anything. Yeah, this you need certain. It, steel. That one still reminds me of like a uh, eating a, a brat. Yeah. So I mean, and I think if you've been into, it, you would understand. But um, people watching at home. But yeah, I think the onion just goes with everything. Dang, that thing wants to be in the face. <laughs> He's flying low. He's spilling beans. He wanted some. <laughs> he probably does. Well, there's a lot of sugar, sugar in, in this. Yeah, we're probably tracking every bee in the country right now. I think I know yellow yellow jackets. All right, last one: the maple, maple and cured, and bacon. cured bacon. Hopefully, that means there's a lot of bacon in there. A lot of maple in this. Oh man, that smells like waffles. <laughs> yeah, I just took a whiff of that sucker. That was. I'm like nervous that there's a bee out right here. So I'm there, they're everywhere right now. Wow, that smells like maple syrup. Oh man, that's your bees right behind yeah, you. Okay. It tastes the same whether it stings me or not. Oh wow, that's maple all the way. That is crazy. Oh, I need a pancake. You ever, you ever had beans on pancakes? <laughs> I don't know, but I didn't feel like I need one. That's odd. Wow. Where to put that one? I don't know what to do with it. That one's such an odd ball. I, I mean, I love the maple syrup. But what would you eat this with? That's a question. Because I'm I'm screaming pancakes I mean, right now. I mean, right now it's got a Waffle. Burger. But what if you took two waffles and a burger patty in the middle? And then put those, man, eat them with the beans right yeah. there? I, I mean, maybe that goes with it. We got a bee over here somewhere. Yeah, it's yeah. a boar bee. I was just watching him because he was like just there looking at you like, hey, you're not supposed to be here. They're probably smelling this. It's probably yeah. up. But, uh, man, I don't know. I, I, it's still better than the original. I don't know. Really? Think? Yeah, I think it's, you don't such, like it? I, I think it's such odd. That it can't be better than the original. Really? Yeah, I think it, it's like right below it because it has. It would have to have something special to go with that. It's so weird. Like, it's too much maple. I like it. I don't know. I think it's. I think it's good. Like, I well, if it. you think it, I mean, I, I think it's technically below it. You think it's above it. Uh, you let me go off the the onion one a little higher, so I'll let you go above the original on this one. But in protest. In protest. Mainly, <laughs> and it mainly depends on what you like. I like that there's a lot of bacon in this one. So, yeah, let's pull them back so people can see her. Oh, yeah. You can see some of these cans, I'm sure. But So here's our list of what you guys can see better than us. Hopefully you can see them all right. We got uh, Country Style, Honey Chipotle. I should have known that one. Uh, I think that's onion. onion, which is crazy to me. But um, bourbon, bourbon and brown sugar. I believe this is the honey sweet in it. Yeah, honey, honey sweet. sweet. Then that's the last the one. Maple. Said, maple original. Original. Then this is the the steakhouse. Steakhouse. Southern pit, which was no good. And then and home, home style, style, which was, was terrible. Was the worst. And it's not that the home style tasted bad. None of this tasted horrible. I mean, they're all beans. I mean, they're, yeah, they're beans. You can eat them anywhere. They're most, probably the most versatile of the fruits. Yeah. I know they're not fruits, but I'm just going to say that. But they're, they're, they all taste good. It's just what we think. Yeah, this is it's, our list yeah. of the Bush's baked beans. By far, would eat that one on the very end. What was that one again? That's the uh, country, country style, style. Which is crazy. I didn't think it would actually make it all the way up. It was uh, the best one by the far. the thickness really helps it. Yeah. So, I there like you my, have it. My beans thick. But yeah, that's that's our uh, bean review. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Hate to be anybody who hangs around us later. No, you. You're the one that's going to be bad about <laughs> I it. I don't know what you're talking about. Anyway, uh, thanks for liking, commenting, and subscribing. Hit that notification bell. Do we have anything new? Anything new? Uh, just uh, go on there and order our shirts and 
and towels and coffee mugs and whatever else we got on there. Support the channel. Oh, I want to let's challenge them. All right. Every hundred. No, I'll say okay. We'll go every five hundred because this is pretty big. Every five hundred viewers, I will trim an inch off my beard. The whole inch. His wife will thank you. <laughs> and, and, and our mother. So five hundred subscribers. I'll I'll trim an inch off this sucker. <laughs> She's gonna be like making up fake accounts. <laughs> So, anyway. <laughs> uh, check out. Uh, we've had some technical difficulties with the gospel DNA. We're just still, still trying to get it up and going and get things moving with the the disease and everything that's going around. It's hard to to really get with people as easy as we wanted to. So just give us a little time. Whenever we start posting, we'll, we'll start posting soon. But uh, thank you for watching, and we love you. And let's get it.